What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person Podcast. My name is Chris. With me is Mike, as always. Howdy doody. Guys, we just want to do a little quick video here for you. We want to talk about Eugene specifically and yeah. how... And just the, the differences between him being with Rick and him being with Negan. And Mike and I were talking about it, and we figured, why not get you guys in on this conversation? Absolutely. Basically... Basically, we, we we were saying how Eugene is was so underappreciated by Rick, and how being with Negan, he not only does he feel appreciated, he's treated essentially like a king. Like he's treated as he's blossomed, <laughs> right? Like 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 how he wants to be treated. Like he's he's very appreciated for his for the, his brain and everything he comes up with. In fact, he he relies he's being relied on by Negan. And you know, his number is number two. His exactly. Number two in, in episode seven. Uh, he says to him, you know, you know, how does it feel to be the second, you know, most important person here? And he says it feels great. So yeah. we just want to do a quick little video about, you know, what wh what is that about? Like, obviously, being being at Rick's, you know, Rick saw him as just one, I, I, just a coward, really. Well, yeah, they did see him as a coward, but at the same time, he he saw him as like part of everything else. Like, he didn't see him as an actual asset. You know, yeah, unlike the, the comics, in the comics, he Rick sees him like Negan does. He sees him as an asset. So I feel like there might be they might have taken mm -hmm. that from the comic and given it to Negan because now it could be. You know, and you know, and, and saying this out loud has given me more insight as to why Eugene did what he did in the in in episode seven, where he was like, you know what, I'm staying here. Where I, I was, can, think, I was thinking the same thing. Right? It's fuel to the fire. It's really. We saw, like I said, blossoming, and we saw Eugene really gain that confidence, especially when he screamed in Gabriel's face. Yeah, right. You know what I mean? So we see the biggest, you know, we see there's a, there's a big discrepancy in the way Re Rick felt towards Eugene and what his, his abilities could be for them. Listen, he could have built, uh, Rick could have been uh, asking Eugene to make the bullets instead of instead of Abraham. Yeah, that right. could be that could be a, a key of why we ne we didn't see the relationship so much um, between Rick and Eugene is because yeah. Abraham was always around. Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, you know how much more could the war have changed? Could the Negan Rick conflict have been if Rick saw that in in Eugene? Well, that's uh, yeah, and so 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 I mean yeah, I mean that's just the whole thing. It's just. You sit here and you think, like, why is he being like this? Why is he doing this? You know, and obviously, you know, Negan is utilizing him in a way. I mean, he's obviously using him, and he's he's expendable. Everyone to Negan is expendable. But yeah, he's giving Eugene what Eugene wants. So why wouldn't Eugene give what, what you know, Negan wants? Yeah. And like I said, it's it's really thinking, saying it out loud is really being like, oh, man, it it, it makes it, it almost makes it, like, less... It makes me less angry at Eugene for not sticking around with his quote unquote traveling companions, which is why he says that. Look, I know he has feelings for them. We know that he it is hurting him to go against yeah. them. But he came to that decision. He had a lot of he had a lot of obstruction. He had a lot of things that were telling him to do to go to the, the positive side of it, to go to his 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 friend's side of it, and he still didn't do it. So that makes him... I think he went up another level after the episode seven. Mm -hmm. That now, he, there may be no way for him to go back. But yeah, it's, it's, an, it's his brain. It's Eugene's number one asset. And yeah, it was, it's, it's a cool little video that, you know, I'm glad that we did this because we were just chatting about it. I'm like, you know, dude, let's, let's do this. You know what I mean? So of course, you know, let us know what, like what you guys think about this and, and do you feel the same way? And do you feel that Negan can even, um, excuse me, that Eugene will e even be able to ever come back? You know what I mean? Do you think, let me ask you that, Chris, do you think that ne um, Eugene can ever get retribution if he does something big or, um, if he ha ends I think, up getting, do you think he can get back into the safe I think, zone? Yeah, do you think yes, be I, I do. I think, I think, I don't know how the TV show is going to play out, but I think what's going to happen, I think what can happen is at some point either either Eugene is going to be forced to to obviously not be on Negan's side for whatever reason Negan's going to get defeated one way or another and he's going to go with his tail between his legs head hanging low back to Rick and be like I'm sorry I was just doing what I had to do to survive and maybe Rick being like you know what I didn't appreciate the things that you did for us when you were here 
Um, and maybe I understand. Now, okay. Yeah. Yeah. And maybe now, like, that's what I would like to see. So Could I'll, be. I'll, I'll just go and say that's what I would like to yeah. see. Yeah. So let us know what you guys think. Because, you know, yeah. because, you know, real quick, it's like when someone's not appreciated, what happens? That's why yeah. people leave the relationships result. and people get divorced yeah. and, Absolutely. and, you know, and, co you know, and people stop being friends. Like, that's what happens. Like, if you're not getting what you need, you're going to go somewhere else to get it. And Eugene is yes, a person sir. that has figured out yes, what sir. he needs to survive, and that's what he – and, you know, so it's it's a good deal for him over there. Listen, mm -hmm. everywhere is scary. Eugene's going to be scared wherever he is. So yep. he realizes if I'm going to be scared, I might as well be scared but be getting – but benefit and, from it. And, and be like that lieutenant. He was never anywhere close to number two in Rick's eyes when he was with, with the Alexandria. Right. He had the importance the when he thought, when they stuff. thought he was taking him to DC, but yeah. yeah. So, uh, yeah, like Mike said, let us know what you think. Answer that yes. question if you like, or, gi or give us a question. If, if, if we've, if we've sparked any, any type of, uh, you know, thoughts, new creative ideas. Yeah. Yes. And of course, if you like the video, share, share it, please Tell share it guys. Yeah. If you like it, yes. yeah, definitely share with people who, you know, like minded people who enjoy the show and enjoy things like this. Definitely share it. Let's grow bigger. Let's get, let's get more people in here. Let's get more people involved in the conversation, things like that's that. That's right. So that's it. Thank you very much, guys. You know how to get in touch with us. We'll see you on the next video. Peace out. Peace.